Hey everybody. Hey, it's Crystal. Again. I hope you never get sick of me. I have a new yarn for you again today from Lion Brand. So I try to keep you guys updated on the new yarns when they come out. So I'm like a yarn weirdo, I guess. I fall I stalk yarn sites. I mean seriously stalk them every night. Every yarn site that I can think of. And see if they put out a new yarn that day. <laughs> it's, it's true. I do do that. So I can get it and tell you guys about it. So I have Lion Brand's newest, I think, as of today. Um, I have not checked their website today, but I will tonight before bed and see if they have anything else. But anyways, this is from Lion Brand. So it's only one yarn in here. I did get all of the varieties. <laughs> I know what's in here. I know what's in here. I have a love-hate relationship with this type of yarn. Actually, I don't even have a love relationship with it. But, what's on it is what I love. First though, I have to tell you, I'm not affiliated with Lion Brand in a way that I get free yarn. Or, uh, I bought this myself. I paid full price for it. And um, I don't have affiliated links to where if you click on my special link, I get money. I don't have that. I actually couldn't care less if you buy the yarn or not. It's only my job on YouTube to tell people when there's a new yarn and my thoughts about it. Because people like to hear my thoughts about yarn. Thank you. I appreciate that. It makes me feel pretty uh, good. All right. But I don't know, I don't have uh, any type of relationship like that with any yarn company. I bought all that yarn back there, so I don't get free yarn. I like to be treated as an equal to my followers. All right, let's go. So let's see. Okay. Okay, you'll, t you'll see why I love this yarn, but I don't like it at the same time. So, uh, but I think I know what I'm going to do with it though. So, I don't remember how much it was. Let me look it up. I'm super excited to get it because of the uh, what's on it. But not really super excited because of the yarn. Okay. First off, oh, I got my new shirt. Do you guys, if you guys know Shira from Mayan Brand, she uh, has the She Show. She's Lion Brand's ambassador. And um, Lion Brand's a family owned company. So uh, she's part of the Lion Brand family. Well, she has a, sh a show that she's called the She Show that she puts on uh, Lion Brand's uh, Facebook, Facebook page and stuff. I like to watch it. She's the founder of Hat Not Hay, where you wear blue hats in um, support of anti bullying. Um, it's an anti bullying campaign. I always make blue hats and send them in and they distribute them out to children, kids and stuff. But anyways, I'll put a link to hatnothate.org down below in case you're interested in that. It's a really good program. Anyways, she has a shirt. The She Show. Check her out on Lion Brand's Facebook page if you haven't seen it. It's, uh, it's good. She brings different people in. I've been on it twice. <laughs> and, you know, she talks to YouTubers, bloggers, all kinds of people. Uh, people that cook and fitness people and just all kinds of stuff, you know, that you know that you could think of. I got my okay, shirt. Okay, quick shirt second. change before I get into the yarn. She friends. I like how it's set up like the Friends TV show, you know. I'll be there for you when the rain starts to pour. I'll be there for you like I've been there before. I can't sing, but let's go ahead and get to this yarn. So this is a uh, Sesame Street off the hook magic yarn. So automatically I'm drawn uh, for nostalgic purposes to anything Sesame Street or anything that reminds me of my childhood when times were easier. Yeah, not a can of world. Well, not too many anyways. But in, in this, and I, I think I said this last time, it's extremely hard to beat nostalgia. It's something that a lot of people strive for. If you get, you see an item and it could snap you right back to childhood, a lot of people you know, like that. I really love nostalgia. So I bought all their last Sesame Street uh, collection. They had uh, their um, 
one hat wonders i have all those um and then i seen this op hook magic sesame street collection of course i have to have it i watch sesame street every day before i went to kindergarten but i'm not a huge fan of yarn off the hook yarn in fact i miss it ah uh, come on lion brand i don't like ripped labels this is gonna put a damper on me trying to collect this yarn now. How am I gonna collect it when the label's busted? Disappointment, that's too. But you know the thing about me, I hate busted labels, especially for brand new yarn that I just paid full price for. Okay, so these are $7.99 a ball. $7.99, so let's look at it. Luckily though, I am going to use this yarn and make something all of them together and then I'm gonna buy them again and use those for keep those for nostalgia purposes but this I do have a plan for okay so this is their um, off the hook magic of course you could tell this is kicking monster right away um, <clears throat> so there's no tools needed you do this by hand if you're familiar with this loop it style yarn uh, now lion brand has it uh, where it's set up that uh, You know you just follow the rows and the collars are put in place to make the The design that you see on the picture, which is kind of neat <clears throat> So I did one one other time when they first came out with it and I really had a hard time with it I guess I don't know. I mean, it's supposed to be easy for children to use but and I can't do it But that's really not saying that much even though that I can't do it, but Let's read what it says. <clears throat> it says, Lion Brand is bringing some magic to Sesame Street. No needles or hooks are required. Simply pull one super plush chenille loop through the other to bring a familiar a friend to life before your eyes. Aww. Choose from Big Bird, Elmo, Grover, Oscar the Grouch, and Cookie Monster. Or collect them all, of course. Kids and parents alike will have a blast. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, we will. Off the Hook Magic Sesame Street is a perfect way to get your kids involved in your love of yarn. And I agree with that, Lion Brand, because I'm going to have Evelyn help me make these. And I know that she can do it probably better than me because <laughs> she's smarter than me and she's five. All right. So let's read about it. Um, it's 95 grams, 100% polyester, polyester machine, washable and dryable. It's classified as a jumbo number seven. Um, this is Cookie Monster. It's really about all it says. Soft, you know, like polyester yarn is. Uh, made in China. And it does give you, it says C step-by-step -step instructions on the other side. And watch Cookie Monster. Cookie Monster smile magically appear while you work. Or visit lionbread.com off the hook for a video to get started. So they have a hook, they have a video for it also. Well, and instructions inside. <laughs> I am not, like I said, I don't really enjoy off the hook. Mainly because I can't do it. But I'm going to do these. And my daughter, my five-year-old, is going to help me. And we're going to put each one of these together. And then I'm going to do something else with them. I'm not going to tell you, but I'll show you when I'm done. So... Here we go. So $7.99 is, it, it makes a square. I wonder how big the square is. Does it tell anywhere? I'll be there for you. No one told you life was going to be this way. Doesn't say. I can't find it. But I don't remember how big the squares are. You know what? I'm going to do one up in a little bit and show you real quick. And then, uh show you what I'm going to do with it. I'm just going to show you what, who they have here. So this is the Cookie Monster. That's what his face looks like. It's pretty cute. Cute, cute, cute. Oh, Grover. Grover. I like Grover. Big Bird. He's a classic. Oscar. Love Oscar. 
And then I got some rip labels here, which I hate rip labels. I hate them, Lion Brand. I hate them. This one could be taped, but the other one's ripped. That's okay, because I'm going to use these all up here in just a minute. Okay, so we have Elmo. So there's two different Elmos. For... There's one Elmo here who does not have a smile. It says, it says eyes and his nose. Oh, this label is really ripped up, Lion Brand. It's all right. It's all right. I'm using it. And this is Elmo smile so he has a mouth on this one so two elmos big bird oscar grover and cookie monster very nice selection of some of the most popular characters on sesame street but you know who my favorite was snuffleupagus he was my fave you know lion run you should do a snuffleupagus and make it a little um for make it free think about that be a good idea. I'd buy it for nostalgia purposes. <laughs> Anyways, okay. So seven ninety nine. I don't think is bad. I don't think that's a bad price, really, considering you know it's a well known childhood character. Uh, what Sesame Street been on for like 40, 45 years or something now? It's still going, I think, with the same characters. Uh, well, I don't know. Same. A lot of the same people that was on it are still on it. New ones, of course, but still. It's been going on for a long time, so it's, it's highly recognizable to everybody. And one of these make a square, and if I remember, it's a nice size square. Um, and I'm going to use all these. I'm going to put them together, and I'm going to make something with it. You guys want to see what it's going to be? You do, don't you? Tune in, because I'm going to get started on it now. i got to have my daughter, Rose, show me how to do this first. So that's it. I just want to show you guys these things. They're, they're really cute. and um, Like I said, it, I don't really like loop it yarn myself, but I couldn't pass up Sesame Street loop it yarn. I mean, who could? If you if you grew up on Sesame Street, it's really hard to, to pass up Sesame Street stuff. And just for me, because I like nostalgia. So um, I'm going to get off here. Line brand, good job on this. I like it. I think it's cool, your technology that you have, that you you don't have to do any, you know, you just go about your business and row by row and it face just magically appears like it says. And it's great. It is good for kids to learn. Get them in the craft. Get them in the yarn. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I like it. I do. I think this is a good product. I, like I said, um, I bought these automatically because they're Sesame Street. And then I bought these because I have a plan for them, all of them. I'm going to use them all in one thing. And then I'm going to buy them one more time to keep for nostalgia purposes. Um, other than that, I don't know if I'll use them for anything else, only because I don't like loop it yarn. <laughs> but it is a cool concept, the way you do it, uh, how easy you make it for uh, adults and children. So it's, it's super cool. So I like it. I'd buy it again. I think their prices are reasonable. I love my shirt. Shira, you're watching. Shira's friends. She friends. Check out her show too on uh, Facebook, Lion Brand's Facebook page. I'll put a link to that below too. All right. Thank you all for watching. Check that, uh, check that yarn out. Tell me what you think. And if you watched Sesame Street when you were little, who was your favorite character? Snuffle up because who's yours? Bye everybody. Look out for this project I got coming up.